What's cracking, guys? This is Nova Last Pause, and today we finally reached 2,000 subscribers! Woo! 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 Hmm. So what does this mean? Uh, it means it's about time I answered your goddamn questions. Uh, so yeah, without further ado, you know, you guys want to know a little bit more about me. So I was like, okay, let's do this Q&A thing. So I did it, took all your freaking comments from the other Q&A Dropbox, and now it's time to do it. Alright, so I'm going to do these questions, no particular order, just going to do them at random, to the best of my abilities, and let's see what happens. Alright, so the first question here is by Mei Lin, and she is saying... Congrats on your 1,500 subs. Ooh. Uh, it's almost 2,000. Actually, <laughs> my question. Uh, where is Megan and Trevor? I miss them. Aw, uh, well, I miss them too. But uh, what happened is that both of them have the focus on their lives. Because uh, I have none. Uh, I took over the channel, and this is the reason why I've been posting a lot of solo content lately, but I did have to have some stuff with Trevor there. So, yeah, this channel mostly belongs to me now. Uh, so, you know, I hope you guys like it. I, if you don't, I'm very sorry, but th that's just how it is. Life happens! Alright, so let's just move on to the next question she has. Um, do you have a girlfriend? Or boyfriend, I don't judge. I, if it's too personal, you can skip this one. Well, guys, uh, it's it's no mystery after Sakura's spirit, I'm guessing. It really isn't. Um, I'm, I love girls. I mean, I, I love girls. Oh, God, I love girls. <laughs> All right, so that's enough of that. Um, yeah, let's move on to the next question. I don't know. She's got a lot of questions. I don't mind answering them. I think it's going to be a long video. Who cares? All right. Do you plan on playing games other than Japanese anime kind of stuff more often? Because I really don't watch those. Next question! Just fucking kidding. Um, yeah, I, I do plan on doing uh, more shit. Uh, I've, I've, I actually try to dedicate one slot uh, in my three videos a day. I'm trying to do three videos, guys. Trust me, guys. Trust me. Um, yeah, I, I try to keep the regular schedule. One at 8, one at 12, and then... Uh, one at another 8 p.m. Uh, it, it happens. Sometimes it, it doesn't happen, but I try my best for you guys. But yeah, I try to, basically I'm getting, I'm ranting off again here. Yes, I'm basically trying to, um, dedicate at least one to Western games. Because I like Western games. You know, it's sometimes, I, 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 I love my anime, but I need some more stuff more often here. Alright, so bada bing, let's move on to the next question here. Alright, this next question comes from, uh, Stadius9. Oi! Have you ever gotten excited while playing a visual novel? Um, I, I, I don't know what you mean by excited, but yeah, I get excited when I play games all the time. I love playing games there. Yes, I'm playing it off like that, you motherfucker. Number two question. Uh, do you have a favorite character? Chamoisy? Ta ta taco Boy? Um, yeah, I actually do have a favorite character. Um, uh, and that would be, uh, obviously, I do love my bro Chamoisy. My god, I had so much fun with Chamoisy. That son of a bitch was one hell of a bro. He was a cool guy. He had, he always just wanted chips in the end, and he also wanted seals, uh, in, in bed. But that, that's another question for another time. I don't know. Number three question here says, uh, and are you Jewish? Now, what makes you think I'm Jewish? Completely terrible jokes aside here. Alright, so we're, we're gonna move on to the to the next question here. I can't do like everybody's question here, otherwise this video will be too frickin', frickin' long here. So let's let's just keep going down. JJ the Snake 124 says, What inspired you to make videos for YouTube and why? Also love your vids and you deserve way more subscribers than you have. Oh what a guy. Alright. Alright, so what inspired me to make videos? Well it's a, it's a number of things really. Um the first one being that uh, I, I just love watching, you know, like other people make YouTube videos, and you know, I figured, uh, why don't I give it a shot? Because I, I, I feel like I'm funny, right? But but seriously, it's guys like the Yogs Cast, the Niga Higa, uh, PewDiePie, even Game Grumps, all those guys—they're just amazing. And I, I I just was inspired to do the same. I I want to try at least. I should try to attempt to be like that. Oh, and I forgot John Trot too. I you forget that son bitch. But yeah, next question here. Jack and Jill says, Noble, will you play any pixel horror games like Ib or Mad Father or Corpse Party, etc.? And what's your sexuality? Have you ever choked a chicken? Mmm, a chicken. What? Come on now. What are you not even being subtle about that shit? That's okay, though. I understand. Um, I already answered the second part to that question. I still like girls. Um, I still think I do. But seriously, um, I, I do plan on playing other horror games there. I, I'm playing Five Nights at uh, Freddy's. Uh, yeah, I've been doing that, and uh, I have another one I think I want to play. 
So I uh, look forward to that one as well. All right, so let's go to the next question here. This all right, so this next one is from Bubblegum Girl three six six. What's your favorite game slash visual novel that you've played so far on your channel? How did you meet Trevor? Do you have a Twitter or Tumblr I can follow you if you do? Love your videos. Heart. Do t I try to comment on, on everyone and show as much support because you deserve every subscriber and way more. Oh, and do you have Twitch? And will you be streaming if you do? I know she is absolutely nothing like this, uh, but I'm uh, sorry about that, Bubblegum Girl. But yeah, okay, let's let's go with the first one here. Um, so, my favorite visual novel game that I have played, there is a, f I mean, out of all of them there, I, I do like my Sacred Spirit, don't get me wrong, but, uh, don't, don't get me wrong, <sighs> um, <laughs> but I, I did enjoy, um, D's, quite a lot, I mean, that game, I did not know what to expect, I had a lot of fun with the characters, everyone was, had like something cool and interesting going on about them, and it was a really, really well made game, uh, by far, I think I had the most fun with D's. Oh, and how I met Trevor. How did I meet Trevor? Oh, that beautiful son of a bitch. <laughs> Alright, so, um, how did I meet that guy? It's a funny story, actually. Um, we, we met in a writing class, and we both hated each other's guts, uh, when we first met each other. Um, he, 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 he thought I was, uh, a, a jerk, which, which I very much am, and I thought he was a pretentious asshole, which, which he also is. Uh, and then, and then after a while, we got used to each other, and and then things kind of happened, you know. We we became manmates, and we we grew to love each other, and you know things have taken off from there. So there you go. It's a, that's my love story with Trevor, and to to all the other stuff, you know, like making a Twitch and Twitter and all that other questions. There, I do plan on doing that shit, but you know, I I just don't have the time right now. I'm barely like holding up with the videos and working life as it is. I just I can't do the social media thing quite yet, but look forward to in the future, uh, I do hope that in the future I will be able to do that, so look forward to it then. And speaking of Trevor, he happens to be this very next question, well let's see what fucking Trevor wrote here. If you entered into a video game deathmatch with Trevor to determine who was the best worst gamer ever, would you A, let Trevor win the deathmatch to prove that you were the worst gamer and thus win the competition, or B, uh, beat Trevor, uh, in the deathmatch but lose the worst, the best worst gamer competition? What the fucking shit, Trevor? That is both what- Oh, what's- what's this next comment say here? The next question is by Elmer Hernandez. Uh, do you play with your Wii? Well, yes, all the fucking time. Wait, wait, no, that's not what he meant. Um, oh, you, oh, you mean the console that I have back there? Here. Yeah, you mean- you, you mean- you mean that- that- that thing in the background there. You guys see it? Yeah, yeah, that- that fucking thing. Uh, no, no, I- I don't really play with that anymore, unfortunately. But I had fun with it in the past. We had our shits and gigs. This next question is by Chris S. S. Uh, I don't know if I said your name right. I'm sorry if I fucked it up. I probably did. Uh, but he says, spoiler alert, Lost Paws is awesome. Oh, thank you. And, and my question is, if, if you were in a zombie apocalypse, what would you do? I, I would probably die. This next question is by Jonathan Proctor. Uh, how old are you? What is your real name? Love the videos and keep up the good job. Oh, thank you. Uh, you I, I will try for you, Jonathan. Uh, and how old I am? I am uh, 26 years old. Um, yeah, born in 1988. And uh, yeah, so I, I hope I, I, I... Do I look it? I don't know. Uh, maybe I do. do I, I think I look fantastic at least. And what's my real name? I'll at least tell you that uh, it's it's noble. Uh, yeah, that's that's my name. So yeah, you could call me that or Lost Paws or Lost Paws, whatever you fucking want. So th that works for you. All right, this next question comes from Evil Klonoa. Uh, that was a good game back in the day. Um, uh, well, it still is a good game, and uh, of course, it was without the evil part. It was just called Klonoa. Um, let's move on. Uh, can we travel around the galaxy in your pleasure, John, and defeat your evil ex-boyfriend while saving every woman, even Vox woman, uh, on each planet? Planet, please. Uh, yes, yes, you can certainly travel on my Pleasure Tron. Everyone's invited on my Pleasure Tron ship. And yes, we can save all the women in the world. Even men, I don't care, I don't judge, I'll save everybody. It's gonna be a great trip, guys. <laughs> Alright, this next question is from Raymond uh, Nguyen. I probably fucking butchered his name. I'm sorry, Raymond. Uh, but I got your first name right. Where did the inspiration for your name come from? How, how did you get it? Where the uh, inspiration for Lost Paws came from, that is a good question. It, 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 it took us several tries to come up with our name for the channel, and eventually I, I did came up with the name uh, Lost Paws, uh, basically because it was Lost Cause. Um, it was basically a, a play off of words from that. 
Uh, because, you know, we, we're terrible at games, to be honest. I mean, look at me. I'm fucking terrible at games sometimes. I get all the wrong routes. And uh, also, it, it's abbreviated to uh, LP, which is short for Let's Play. So I thought that was also clever. So we do Let's Plays on Lost Paws. It was, it was, it was a good thing. I thought it was great. It was fantastic. And, and we did it. All right, this next question comes from uh, Guile Hammer first. I, I think I said his name right. So yeah, question on... Did you manage to find any hentai similar in story or art to Sakura Spirit? Actually, Sakura Spirit wasn't a hentai, it was just a regular game, just with a lot of fan service. One less important question, you planning on playing games other than novels? If so, what kind of game it if you would be interested in some collab play? That was a bit of an awkward sentence there, but I did my best there. Um, so, I, if I did find another game like Sakura, there is no other game that is as fucking fan servicey as Sakura Spirit that I can play on YouTube without it taking off my butt cheeks. I, I, I'm very attached to them. It, they let me sit down. Uh, I would be playing them right now, but I'm still on the lookout for them. I'm always on the lookout f uh, for games for you guys. So yeah, don't, don't worry. I always try to find something just to show you guys. And, uh, yes, I do plan on playing games other than novels. Um, I, I'm playing them right now, so I hope you enjoy that. This next question is from W. D a Drapper. Do you know the Game Grumps? Yes! Alright, this next question comes from Halbert Gaming. You say you're noble of Lost Paws, but is there anyone else in Lost Paws? If you go by another alias, it leads some people to think that there are more people in, uh, on the channel. Anyway, why don't you ask a few friends to do some skits or something? Yeah, friends. I... I have those. I have friends. But seriously, um, I, 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 ha I say it's, I'm noble of Lost Paws for, you know, a very good reason because it's kind of awkward saying it another way. Because, uh, you know, like saying, uh, it's, this is Noble's Lost Paws or Lost Paws is noble, it just sounds fucking weird. So I'm just gonna keep saying this is Noble of Lost Paws unless you guys can think of a better way to say it. So yeah, um, let's move on. Alright, so this next question comes from Joseph Sarna. Oh, what made you play these somewhat intriguing games, if you get my drift, Nobel? What made me play these games? I mean, come on, really, what made me play those fucking games? It's quite obvious what made me play this. I just like playing games that are out of the ordinary. It's just kind of what I am, because I'm kind of out of the ordinary, if you guys haven't guessed that so far. But yeah, don't, don't worry about that. Uh, I try to play games that are interesting for me, so that they're interesting for you as well, because, you know, if I'm not interested in a game, it's not going to be interesting for you, because I just won't be behind it. So, you know, I'm going to try my best to find, like, games that are cool, that you'll like, and maybe play some mainstream games too, as well. So, bam, there you go. Alright, this next question comes from Rebecca Lai. Can you do all the male-female voices from Sakura Spirit while making up dialogue? If, if so, do it right now on the spot. Fucking shit, are you kidding me? I can barely remember their goddamn dialogue things, but alright. Sure, I'll give it my best. Oh, no. My boobs are hanging out, by the way, I'm a Chico. Oh, God, they're all over the place. Please, can you help put them back in? Oh, Nate chan what are you doing? Tuck those things back in. Oh, no, my butt is showing. I'm Mako, by the way. Oh, God, it's all over the place. Baka, just look at me. Just look at me right now, Baka. Stupid dummy head. Taco boy, Noble. Do you want some chocolate, Noble? Oh, God, yes. Um... Okay, so that's that's my dialogue for that. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, I know I did. So let's just move on. All right. So this next question comes from Aperture One Hundred Two. Enter completely inappropriate. Well, shit, sure. If he wants me to do that, I'll just fucking do that. Oh, all right, oh, here you come. Oh, yeah. oh shit, I'm talking about my complete, completely inappropriate. I just. Oh, there we go. Completely inappropriate. Oh, there we go. Alright, next question. If you choose either saving Trevor's life or getting $10 million, what color would your Lamborghini be? F the color of Trevor's fucking blood. This next question comes from uh, Connor Moody. Question. With so many games and so many groups, FPS, sandbox, RPGs, etc., uh, why have you picked uh, what you have? That's a good question. Why did I choose these games? Well, it's because they're just kind of fun to do. Just to goof around and play in. Where I can be my own thing. I'm always on the lookout for a good sandbox game. Or more FPS's and RPG's that I can just be a total goofball in and do shit. Just for fun, shits and gigs. Uh, so, you know, I, I just kind of go with the flow. Find the games I like. And hopefully, they'll be the games you guys like too. So look forward to more games. This next question comes from Alex McRandom. Yes! Well, I, I don't think that was the question. Alright, so this next question comes from Muhammad Shiki. I, I, I don't know if, you, if I said that right. I probably butchered it again. I'm sorry if I did. Alright, so Q&A. 
Who's your favorite character in Sakura Spirit, and what type editing do you use in your video? I want to learn from you, Master Noble. Um, oh, okay, um, who's my favorite character in Sakura Spirit? That's a fucking hard question. If you guys watch the series, I had trouble, you know, ch picking favorites. I ch they switched all the time. I, I was hard for me, man. It's hard. Hard for me. But it's definitely fucking Machiko. But okay, uh, what, what kind of type editing do I use? I, I'm not sure what you mean by that question, but I use, to edit my videos, I use Corel Video Studios. Uh, X7, I believe it is on now. Uh, so yeah, I, I do that, and the name of the font is called, uh, Harvest. So that, that's the type, that's the type of font I use. This next one, this next question comes from Bradley Sweatland. Uh, or Sweatland, you know, fucking, I'm terrible with names. Uh, you guys probably know this by now. If I ever run for president, can I count on your vote? Also, what's your favorite vegetable? Um, yes, I, I will definitely vote for you. Uh, why the fuck not? And also, uh, what's my favorite vegetable? I would say broccoli. It's bushy and fucking green. I mean, seriously, so bushy, so green. This next question comes from Starfish Swift. I don't know if it's related to Taylor Swift. Maybe she is. Or she. We don't judge. What phone do you have and what made you get it? I, I have a... What the fuck kind of phone do I have right now? I have a, a, a droid 4G Lite. That's the fucking phone I have right here. Uh, this motherfucker interrupts me all the time when I'm doing videos. It's a son of a bitch, but I do love it to death. What made me get it? It's because it was the latest model of droid at the time, and I wanted a smartphone, uh, because it's very fucking handy to have. So I, I got it. Th that's the story. Alright, you sons guns. Uh, I didn't think that this, uh, Q&A would drag out this long. I still have lots of questions to go and stuff like that, so I'm gonna have to split it up into... Two parts. Oh god, I know, I know. That's that sounds bad, but you know, I I I'm sorry, but we're we're gonna do it. We're gonna get the rest tomorrow. I promise you, sons of guns, there. And you know, I'd also just like to say thanks, thanks guys, seriously, uh, for you know making this possible. Two K subs is freaking ridiculous. You guys are freaking amazing, and I just can't thank you guys enough. Uh, I'm gonna try and work my hardest to get you guys as much as the rest of this video tomorrow. And make it prompt, make it swift. You know, I'll step up my game here just for you guys, because you guys are sons of guns. You guys are the best sons of guns. So once again, thank you guys so much for watching this vid, and I'll see you guys again next time.